family welcome back to our channel before we get into today's video don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and please subscribe if you have not done so already so today is our last day in new orleans we're uh going ahead we're going to grab some breakfast right now and uh probably visit a couple more areas before we start heading back to florida say hi guys hello jordy's back there mad because lano just turned her music off <laughs> she'll, she'll survive listen. um but anyways i will get back to you guys as soon as we get to the restaurant that we are going to all right guys so we are here at toast super excited to try this breakfast hopefully it's delicious so guys we checked out the restaurant we put our names on the list it is a 45 minute wait to sit inside so we are waiting in the car because it's really cold outside again today but we did see a few plates walk uh being walked by us as we checked in and the food looks amazing guys babe what do you think you think it looks good right so we are super excited to That's try it out waiting. yeah for, um because it looked amazing and it smelled really good and i think you have to wait outside because it is a small restaurant right it's pretty small in there but it smells good and they are playing music in there so it'll probably be like an, a quick shot of like the food of us probably uh biting into it because they are playing music in there unfortunately um but yeah we are super excited to try it out hopefully it's as good as it looks and it smells because it smells amazing too but we will get back with you guys as soon as we get inside So guys, we left the restaurant and guys, oh my gosh, that food was amazing. Like, babe, tell them, cause you're picky. It, it was good. I never, it was amazing, I, I never I get away I from Is my, that a ladybug? my comfort zone. There's a zone. ladybug in, in my window. Look guys. Uh, I'm talking. Oh my oh god. Oh my god. <laughs> can't even explain my food. Can't even explain. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. All right, go ahead. A, la a ladybug. Yeah, a you ladybug. Know, a small little bug. I got it. All right. Anyways, go. back to my chicken and waffle. Yeah. I'm not, I'm, not, I'm really picky. I'm a really picky eater. Um, But that chicken and waffle was actually like amazing. It really so was. So were my pancakes. So yeah, literally me and the waitress and their had to. Balls. Oh my gosh, their pancakes. I don't know what awesome. I know they got a name, but 
I don't know, but what pancake balls were there? Me and like me and the waitress literally had to convince. <laughs> Sorry, Lionel, to get um the chicken and waffles because he's such a picky eater. So I was telling him like, no, they're so good, they're so good, and she was like, what did she say? She told him to live a little. <laughs> My review is like I'm, I'm living. So I'm living. he did live and he actually liked it. Um, but anyway, so wait, hold on, Jazz. So we were driving out of, um, we were leaving the restaurant and we saw like this derby place and um, the horses were so cute, guys. Lionel actually got a little clip of them, so I'm gonna go ahead and insert it so you guys can see it. But it was the cutest thing ever. Like I could literally sit there and watch horses just walk all day because they're just, they're so beautiful. I freaking love them. Um, but anyways, let me go ahead and insert that. And then Jazz wants to say her review on the restaurant. <coughs> oh, here we go. Oh, stop it. Oh, okay. Jojo. So my review. I'm not Jojo Siwa. I look nothing oh. like her. <clears throat> Anyways, so my pancakes, I had pancakes. They were like, um, the waitress said she, they were the size of golf balls. It's true. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of laugh is that? You're, you're interrupting my review. <laughs> People these days, or grown-ups these days. Anyways, so, <clears throat> back to my review. They were the size of golf balls. They had powder on them. And the pancakes I ordered were Nutella pancakes. So, like, it came, like, a, with a, a little jar that had Nutella in it. And then I just had to dip my golf ball pancakes with powder in it into the Nutella and eat it. It was so good. Plus, I had hot chocolate. So good. Yeah, their food was really good. I had a bacon, egg, and cheese on a biscuit, so I really enjoyed it. Jordy was kind of picking off of everyone's plate, so she oh, had a little bit of everything. Guys, actually, I have one more thing. This. Okay, guys, so I'm gonna show you. Did you mention what's the restaurant's name? It's I did. Toast. It's called Toast. I showed them even the outside of it. Okay, guys. This thing right here. Oh, Jasmine this, brought leftovers. This, Guys, we never bring leftovers, and Jasmine actually brought leftovers. It's like mom made me, mom didn't make me try it, but I wanted to try it because she said it was really good. It, it's like this sauce, Um, it's like a butter sauce with pepper and, and like sour cream. Cayenne butter, I think she Cayenne called it. Cayenne butter, yeah. And um, it's so, so good. It's all yellow with green stuff in it. It may sound gross, but it's really not. It's like super good. So I left, um, I had left, I bring leftovers, I asked her for leftovers, so we got the cayenne butter in it, and with some french fries, and we have Doritos at the back at the hotel. So and, and are are, are we vlogging or are we reviewing, uh, uh, uh the pit? oh. So, we have Doritos back at the hotel, uh, so we can dip it, and the box, it says Jazzy's and Mom's food, no touch dad. Cause he always throws away your stuff, so I, so I put dad don't touch. So yeah. Let me see that. Here, it says dad don't touch. Oh, you really put that there. <laughs> Told you. All right, guys. So now, um, earlier I said this was our last day in New Orleans, but Lionel decided to just spontaneously decide to decided to stay another night. So. It's not our last day in New Orleans. We're gonna stay one more night and we're gonna go ahead and leave tomorrow. So we're trying to see what we can do indoors because it's, freezing. it's so cold outside and um, everything that Lionel wanted to do is outdoors, but it's so cold. So we're trying to see what we could get into indoors now so once we get there we will let you guys know and show you guys exactly what we're doing hey guys so after 
going to the hotel, taking a wonderful nap, freshening up a little bit. We decided to go to the Mardi Gras Museum, you said? Mardi Gras Museum. So we are super excited and we will let you guys know once we get there. Guys, we are here. We're super excited. Let's see what this has in store for us. We can do it together. So here is the Ooh. entrance, guys. Scary. Jazz and Jordy are scared of those two things. But yeah, there's a car, so I gotta move. That's Jordy scared of everything, guys. No, I need to take one on the angle. Art tops in more ways than one. Artistic imaginations run wild with creations that can be shocking, funny, scary, and downright spectacular. The creative process of float building by the Kearns is a fascinating blend of imagination, artistry, design, carpentry, and a strong sense of everything sensational. From seemingly mild-mannered artisans come some pretty fantastic images. The day after Mardi Gras, we generally come back here and start the design process again. From there, we essentially get a list of themes from the different captains to expressing what they want to develop as far as themes for the uh, coming year. And we start with generally what we call a thumbnail, which is a rough sketch. <laughs> Tampa rice. Tampa rice.
All right, guys. So we just left the Mardi Gras museum, I guess, or tour. Guys, that so was amazing. Oh my goodness, just seeing all the details and all the how, how they started. Yeah, like it's just crazy that it starts from foam. Like all of those props start from foam, and to think that it's just foam and paper that's creating that it's insane uh but it was night nice. it was awesome we learned a few things we learned that when they do the parade they hand out or throw out 250 million beads that's insane that's a whole lot of beads guys i actually have another fact that's not related to Oh my gosh, Jazz, goodbye. Oh, and then no. the um, another it. thing is that the colors purple, green, and gold stand for... Do you remember what it was? I forgot what it was. I know one of them was for... I know one was... Power. Power. That's the gold one. Just, no. Justice, Justice. is the green and one, peace. I believe. And peace was the purple one. Yes, so purple is peace green is justice or is it the other way around and gold is power um i'll definitely uh sir insert uh the meanings of them if we said it the wrong way but yeah those were the three it was peace justice and power right i think yes right yeah guys i think oh my God, but yes. i will definitely insert the uh the correct order and the correct words in case i said it wrong but guys let us know what was your favorite part my favorite part was seeing the float like i mean all the decoration was awesome but seeing the actual floats was awesome i think that was like my favorite part and actually seeing the gentleman on a computer showing how they cut the foam because i think that was the foam right that was the foam. that was the foam showing how they cut the foam was another of my favorite parts so let us know in the comments what was your favorite part jazz what was your favorite part so one of my favorite parts was definitely taking pictures with the the, the panda and the the, the lion so cute um the other one was the princess and the frog. Oh. Okay, and then dad, what was your favorite part? The making, the the way that he put the program like in, like while well, he put the sketch, he was actually doing the sketching on the computer while it, to make it yeah. like. Oh. He's got to be, he's got to be a well-creative mind person. And yeah. my two least favorite parts was definitely the Chucky and the Pride one. Um, and the second one was, there was like this, this, it was like, Chucky. It was like a green glob thing and it had something sticking out of his eye. And actually one more, there was this witch with eye sticking out. Right oh my place. gosh. And Jordy, what was your favorite part? Tiger. <laughs> what was Jordy's favorite part? Did you like the tiger? I think you like the tiger too. Stop in there with your mouth. You're, I, she's been acting like a baby lately and it's so annoying. But I think Jordy's uh, favorite part was the tiger because when she saw it, she literally kept trying to walk away from us to go to the tiger. Oh, and Scooby's my favorite. Oh yeah, Scooby was cute too. But yeah, let us know again what was your favorite part now we're currently on our way to back to la salle street i think it's called la salle street. Canal. canal you said la salle street is it canal or la salle canal, canal street that's why the one we were walking down was la salle street that's why i thought it was la salle street um but anyway so now we're heading back to canal street because we want to get some piña colada because we've been dying to try them since the first day we came here and they've been, out the, they've been out, sold out 
or the machine had been down so we're hoping that we can finally get to taste it so if we are able to we will definitely show you what they look like tell you how they taste and yeah <laughs> we'll get back with you guys in a little all right guys so we finally got back to the hotel we got our willie's cocktail pina coladas yeah. they are so amazing they're really good we wanted to drink them walking down canal street but unfortunately it's way too cold to be holding these drinks outside so we just brought a Lionel bought them we brought them back to the hotel and we're just gonna stay in for the rest of the night order some pizza and so we are gonna go ahead and close out the video right here we hope you guys enjoyed it and let us know in the comments what do you guys think about our little spring break vacation here in new orleans and that's pretty much it right babe you have to add anything else all right guys so we're gonna go ahead and end it right here don't forget to like comment share and subscribe and we'll be back with more videos bye guys, bye guys. Bye guys.